Welcome to my channel. This is Sam, and I'm playing Red Dead Redemption 2. Okay. Okay. So I just paid off my bounty, and uh, we have hunted down animals and fishes, and done some things, regrettable, and also let me see. Challenges. Monster hunter. Um, three perfect content. Okay, I have to do all this. Sharp shooter. Okay. So this is like too much time needed okay so let's start with the main missions now i have done many things i have shown where to sell the meat sell the legendary pelts and a trap for a poor trapper let's go because uh, jose is waiting here this one i have marked this place uh, for some reasons we'll discuss that later let's go Necessary. Talking about like uh, 16 legendary items, some of which you get in new hosting. It is in black water, so that way you can be sure. In that place, I know how many times that is, how many times I died. But I did not follow anything, I was just roaming around in the sleep room. One to roam around, two roads in black water. <laughs> okay, let's start with the mission then. It's already been too long since I did this main mission. Okay, let's uh, I will just check around. A little bit, then I'll do this. Was a random mission just pop out? I, I, I don't have much to say. Life's always confused me. I, I don't feel I understand it very much. I like that. Other human beings seem to understand why they were born, but for me, it seems like I was born to hurt, 
and, and suffer myself. Yeah, that's that's always like How you still got good. tan fingers is a miracle. Just sharpened it. You were snoring, that's all. Yeah, I'm going back to sleep. You awake yet? Uh, what do you need, Arthur? Ah, uh, don't worry. It can wait. Let me sleep, damn it. <laughs> I'm just disturbing everyone. <laughs> okay, I just paid off my bounty and it was staggering high. I don't have anything to contribute to. I will not contribute now. Maybe later. To do with a few improvements. Why don't you take a look at my ideas? I'll keep my eye out for some good material. I just bought him from there. Oh, uh, that guy is very softy. You see, he is softy. Okay, I'm okay. Jose, hey Arthur, come on. If we're gonna make it to this party, we sure as shit better clean up a little. So we're doing this? Oh yeah. Old friend Dutch Van der Linder's finally showing his true colors. Social climbing. <laughs> Old Senor Bronte, that horrendous snake, has invited us to the ball, Cinderella. So my suggestion is we go and get you a gown. <laughs> you son of a bitch. <laughs> I will shave when I come back to the we are ridiculous, <laughs> utterly. I ain't never been to a ball in my life. Nor have I, if I am being honest. I used to quite often. There can be fine pickets. Oh, no, 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 no pickpocketing. We are here to make real contact. What kind of contact? Well, I don't know. We'll find what we can. All I know for sure is we are going to a party at the mayor's house, and the guest of honor is the worst crook in town. <laughs> I'm sure that we will find something. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Gentlemen, Luca, I'm afraid the mayor does not allow guns at official functions after last year's incident. Luca here will take you to Mr. Bronte. I believe he is expecting you. Follow me, gentlemen. This way, please, gentlemen. Senior Bronte will be so pleased that you made it. We are honored to be here. Ah, that's wonderful, wonderful. That. Come on, this way. Uh, what a beautiful evening it shall be. Mr. Brante is a very good friend is. with the mayor. Glory. Good evening, Pierre. Senor Napoli. As long as the mayor behaves himself, you know, Mr. Brante, he has a the thing, you know, a respect. Jose, Bill, you joining the party? We'll meet you out back after we pay our respects to Senor Brante. Come, go. I don't know if I don't follow the mission then. Hope from this way is not possible. Okay, let's go in the way. I'm the way we can see. Oh, 
this way. This way, please, gentlemen. A senior brother will be so pleased that you made it. We are honored to be here. <laughs> That's wonderful, wonderful. That. Come, come, this way. Uh, with a beautiful evening, it shall be. Mr. Brante is a very good friends with the mayor. Good evening, Pierre. Senor Napoli. As long as the mayor behaves himself, you know, Mr. Brante, he has a the thing, you know, respect. Okay, so hey, you know, this one. You join the party. Okay, we'll meet you out back thing. after we pay our respects to Senor Brante. Come, come. We'll meet you out for the balcony when you're done. This is quite a party you've invited us to. Yes, quite something. Although I'm not quite sure what. So, this is Sandini High Society. Yes, apparently so. And all these people, these are friends of yours, Senor Bronte. No, 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 not quite, not quite. But they certainly are afraid of me. Like that one. See that wretch? He's the mayor. <laughs> Henri Lemieux. <laughs> he can do anything for a dollar, and I mean anything. Politics is a foul business. Yes. Oh, and that one too. That is Alberto Fuzar. He owns a sugar plantation out on the island, and he comes here to whore and despoil himself. <laughs> Oh, oh, and that, that is Hobart Crowley, <laughs> a, a Confederate major in the war, I and mean, a hero, they say, but that, this is his very young wife. I mean, a young mistress, that's the natural order of things, yes, but a young wife is unseemly. Oh, oh, the Redskins. <laughs> I have no sympathy for them, because whoever is stupid enough to get tricked by the Americans, no, they get what they deserve, huh? <laughs> yes, and a letter to the mayor. Oh, yeah, that'll save you. <laughs> and that... That is Hector Fellows, this self-righteous newspaper man. Maybe, maybe you will kill him for me one day. <laughs> well, we're not paid killers as such, not in cold blood anyway. I did not know you were so particular that uh, you wouldn't help a friend. Oh, I'm willing to help in any way I can, uh, within reason. <laughs> I'm going to pretend to understand what that means. I meant no offense, sir. Oh, none taken. None taken! <laughs> <laughs> All these vulgar people, they hate me. Non vedo l'ora di guardarti morire! Well, uh, it has been wonderful conversing with you, but I can tell that you are very busy and I won't waste any more of your time. Yes, yes, yes. Go, enjoy yourselves and mingle with this vulgar scum. It'll make you long for the days when you could shoot each other and screw cows out on the open range. <laughs> Those sure were the days. <laughs> good day, gentlemen. Mm, good day to you. But before you go, what uh, exactly are your plans here? Well, we've not made any... Well, we, we are going to need some money. Money, yes, of course. Well, there's, there's money at the trolley station. They keep a lot of cash there in the day. Now, I could not involve myself in such uh, matters. But you... Pff, as a guest, yes. As my guest, bah, do it, huh? <laughs> okay, good day, gentlemen. Goodbye. <laughs> I think he's trying to clean us. Okay, ragazzi, adesso il vino buono. Because he, really <laughs> and, uh, because he like, knows all the people. I'll show you to the party, gentlemen, if you'll kindly follow me. can easily influence them to believe that we were the main culprits and not him. who was planning it all behind the max the place very mentioned Gentlemen, enjoy your evening and welcome once again to Sandini ciao ciao gentlemen let's go ingratiate ourselves let's go okay go find the mayor if you can <laughs> 
and stay out of trouble and steal nothing unless it's information. Of course. Jose, you go find us some place to rob. Bill, go make us some new friends. I'm gonna find out if old Cornwall, what's his name? Milton knows we're here. Gentlemen, be well. I was just confused. So this video is going to be about these these people, I guess. Okay, these people have seen the Get me a bloody drink. Can I interest you in a glass of champagne? Just big enough for me to swim the lengths, you know. Well, hello, gentlemen. Truth is an absolute sign. Don't you think? Glad to hear. Take care. You I take care. Understand. Well, you are not, it would seem, the only one. Hi there. <laughs> How do you and do? What do you do, Mr. Lafano? Originally, first. How's it going? I cannot really think of anything to complain about right at this moment. That's good. All the best, then. Bye for now. Well, more like 23%. How do you do? How do you do? And evening all. The usual bunch of clowns in New York. Do you bank with anyone? Evening, folks. How do you do? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just greeting everyone. I can't lie. The Lord's blessed me. I need a big bank, sir. That's the spirit. All the best. Generate a lot of cash. Some nervous. How's it going with you? Finish us in a bag. You think of anything to complain about right at this moment? We handle more cash and cash equivalents than any bank south of Manhattan, including St. Louis. So, don't let me keep you. Good day. Thanks with us. We work with all the remaining cotton growers in the U.S. who still use a lot of cash, and we help finance half the reconstruction projects after the war. We're a lot of people. You okay? Oh, my lord. The pesky nut. What a way to go, eh? Oh, thank you, sir. Oh, yes. Thank you. Algernon Hello? Uh, Cassidy's Kilgore. Hello, Mr. Kilgore. Like... No, what is it that, uh, that you do? I'm, uh... I'm an adventurer. Oh! And me too! Pursuer of the exotic and the remarkable. An estate in this land of commonplace... heathens. My card, sir. Give me a visit in my atelier. I must destroy and purge. I intend to stay thin until I pass away. Good evening. I need to talk to the mayor, but first I need to talk to the ladies. ladies. Hello, sir. How's it going? Feeling blessed. That's good. All the best, then. See you soon. 
Monsieur Roussalou, how are you all doing? Monsieur? How are you doing? Very well, thank you. That's your spirit. All the best. Au revoir. Evening all. Mais bonjour. You remind me of a feller I used to know. Sorry. Can't put my finger on it. Farewell. Evening, gentlemen. Bonjour, monsieur. How's it going? Wonderful. Thanks for asking. Good. All the best now. A une prochaine fois. Good evening. Bien, bonjour. It ain't complex, am you? And only an idiot like you, buddy, would try to make it so. I will not deny idiocy so, but perhaps now is not the time. <laughs> Typical pansy! You are drunk, Ferdinand. <laughs> I'm not drunk, you fool. But this man, this man loves darkies. Hey, <laughs> you are pretty drunk. Yeah. We'll see you and me cool off. Hands off me. Come on, sleep it off. Sit down and calm down. Count to a thousand. Then you can rejoin the party. Hello, sir. Evening, sir. How do you do? Hi there. Hello there. Oh, hello. Evening, ladies. Bonjour. Evening, gentlemen. How's things? Splendid, as it were. Glad to hear. Take care. See you around. Evening, folks. Chérie. How are you all doing? Hello, mister. How's it going with you? I'm okay. Good for you. See you around. Thank you, sir. My pleasure. Henri Le Mieux. I hope you're enjoying my party. The mayor. Allegedly. There's quite a place you got here. <laughs> it's not mine, and the city is horribly in debt, but we can still put on a good show. Do you know Evelyn Miller? My lord. Ryder? Well, we seem to have another deranged drunkard on our hands. Shall we? Oh! Oh! My lord, they're fantastic. <laughs> Excuse me, pardon. Excuse me, pardon. Ah, uh, monsieur, please. Mr. Cornwall was quite insistent, I'm afraid. Uh, he shouted down the telephone for several minutes. Mr. Cornwall is a horse's ass and a bad horse. I'm very sorry, sir. It's not your fault. I'm a fool for trusting him. I'll come and sign it for a minute. Let me enjoy the fireworks. Of course. Did he say something about Cornwall? Yes. Find out what. Sure. Sir? How's it going? Things are mighty fine indeed. Hello there. Oh, how do you do? Ma'am. Chérie. Good evening. Sir? Hello? How's things? Things are mighty fine indeed. No problems? Everything's fine. We have the place well secured. Good. Mr. Bronte has a habit of wandering about and reading whatever he likes. <laughs> We're watching him and his men like hawks. Thank you, Mr. Turner. I don't think anybody else is here. So good. The telephone, it keeps dinging. The mayor said he will sign later.
Marie! Find that little reprobate Chip and beat him. I will not have standards slip in this house. Have you lost your mind? I said, have you lost your mind? Come here. Come here. Look at me. Look at me. Who do you think you are? This area is not meant for the likes of you. You know this. The standards in this house are slipping. This is a final warning to you, miss. A final warning. Now get out of my sight. He's going in. I don't know what is he. Let's see what this spot is. Getting caught in You can just go out of the way Maybe not. Arthur? Gentlemen, I think we're done here. What did you find out? There's plenty of money, Moose, through here, of course, and I think I found out how we can grab some of it. Big bank. Real one, I mean. But not yet. A city bank? Maybe. And a stuffed one. If we're gonna leave. That could be the one thing we need. There's also that trolley car station Senor Bronte told us about, and I heard about a high-stakes poker game. Come on. Here comes Lenny. All right. Let's get in. <coughs> Go home! I ain't never felt so awkward in all my life. All them folk are so pleased with themselves. Oh, high society's pigeon shit. If you ask me, it's more like torture. Well, that's sort of the point, isn't it? Let the people torture themselves. Here's them papers I took. Let <sighs> me see you take this. I don't think so. Hmm. I might have an idea. Let me think on it. So this mission <coughs> supposedly uh, unlocks some <laughs> side missions, I guess. Interesting times, I guess. So what's next? 
Dancing lessons, deportment, more along the lines of armed robbery. Jose is handling reconnaissance on the bank. He and Abigail are gonna run some distractions, see how the law react. Good. Oh, and I spoke to Evelyn Miller, fine man. Here helping the Indian chief we saw. Yeah, I met him too, with the mayor. He's lobbying officials in San Denis on their behalf. Maybe we could help. Maybe. Now, I think there's a lot of money on the riverboat. A lot of money. And Trelawney, he's investigating for us. He says to meet him at the tailors. Okay. One big score down here, Arthur, and we disappear. We are almost heading home. Where is home? I don't know. Exactly. But I can smell it. I'm gonna go investigate this trolley thing old Bronte was talking about. Okay. <sighs> Maybe I will go for the high stakes. While at the party, pour some drinks, compliments, kiss, satire, to give them save a life. What the fuck? So you guys can replay the mission here, do all this stuff, but I'm not gonna do it. Just for a silver medal. I saved a life. That guy was choking. Okay. So I see no missions here. This one's. Let's meet this. Good morning, Arthur. You said that. Miss Roberts. So let's do some chores. We're getting the horse. Says. It's like uh, as if you can talk more or play more with kind of shit. I'll talk less and play more. Okay. That's why I just uh, got the. Uh, that's why I edited the videos where I paste and I. Uh, hunted animals. And that part so boring going from one place to other place searching for a clue. You guys search for the clue yourselves. Come on, just pick it up. Why can't I pick this up? Good seeing you in action with those foreman boys, like the old days. Oh, I'm just glad we got Tilly back. Yep, just in time. I just don't uh, know where this log, this round shaped log, which I have to piece into 
and do this show. At least somebody is doing some chores around here. Nobody else is doing it. I'm the one. Nice to see you working, Arthur. Yeah. It'd be nice if you would start working too. I was not able to pick this up. Now. Hey! Morning. How you doing? This makes my second show the day done. Fuck. Make sure my horse gets up. Have you seen Karen? What about these horses? Nobody's feeding them. I cannot do this here, man. Why? Make camp yet, so I have to go out again. Okay. Let's go out of the camp. I'm not doing that soon. Yep. There's somebody else walking. So we are going to send them aside. So it's just faster than up it will be faster. Come on. out on the side missions what I did uh, in chapter 2 was this that I missed what I've done a lot of side that. missions Oh, this guy he gave his card. We saved this guy from choking. 
For one moment, please. Hey. This is extremely delicate. There. Oh, wonderful. May I help you? Well, uh, I don't know. I met you, remember? At that party? Oh, yes. You saved my life. Oh, I am eternally yours, Algernon Wasp, purveyor of the exotic and the exquisite, Enchanté. Uh, Tacitus Kilgore. How can I help you? May I interest you in a uh, hat, perhaps? Uh, How about a nymph? I import them from Brussels. The idiots in this town all want Italian nymphs, but the Italians make the coarsest of marble. I mean, quite frankly, the Baroque is an abomination. Belgium. Now that is a land for the connoisseur. Oh, yes. Yeah, as I always say. But, you know, I'm not really a nymph kind of man. No, of course, too ephemeral. You want something, uh, more tangible, more gothic. I also make corsets. Would you like a corset? I always wear one. Uh, no. I don't think so. Yeah, I ride a lot of horses, and the whalebone might stick in. Mm, well, a cup of tea. Uh, sure. And what is it you do, Mr. Kilgore? Are you a gentleman of leisure? An aesthete? <gasps> an artist. Uh, I suppose I'm <clears throat> kind of an adventurer. Ha! Huh. Yes, of course you are. Here, be careful with the china. Sir, it is French. No Belgian? No, 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 no. They are Philistines in that area not to be trusted. Youth, eternally preserved in marble is more their specialty. I fear China will always elude them. Now, why are you here exactly? I don't know. You're an adventurer, a wanderer, a lost soul cast out from heaven? <sighs> sure. Well, I do pay exceptionally well for certain objects needed for my art. Mm, you do? I do. Exceptionally well. Well, what do you need? Let's see. Right now, I have a couple of commissions. I need at least 15 egret plumes. Good ones, obviously. I also need... Fifteen assorted orchids. Here's a list. Okay. I will see what I can do. Thanks for the tea. Thank you, Tacitus. It'll be very worth your while. Five little egret plumes, five reddish egret plumes, five small egret plumes, five tame lady of the night of the Which one to do first? What Let's see if the stranger was that. Because we all want to learn that. After meeting the stranger, we will go first. Good morning, sir. Hello. Buenos dias, señor. <clears throat> Mister? This mission is not that far. This stranger. This mission with the gang might be able to help every miller with the law. Logging officials and soldiers and the other means for the native Okay. Anything to spare for a blind man? Oh, thank you, sir. Uh, truly, thank you. It means a lot to me. Oh, 
Oh, good day to you. Do you have anything you can spare for a blind man? I believe we met. We have. At that ghastly party. Oh, Evelyn Miller. Unfortunately so, Mr. Uh... Arthur Morgan, at least sometimes. Uh, can I say something rude? Sure. The mayor thinks you robbed him. Oh, to be clear, he, he wasn't very upset about it. He rather liked you. Okay. Do you, uh... Well, I mean to say... Uh, can you steal things? Is there a reason you're asking me to incriminate myself, Mr. Miller? Well, I'm sorry. Have you met? This is Rain's Fall, a great chief, and his son, Eagle Flies. Gentlemen, yeah, we saw you in the wagon train crossing the river at Cumberland Falls. And at the party, you were upstairs. You have great powers of observation. Yes, my people, if we are even a people anymore. We've fought hard. We've made peace treaties, and those treaties were broken, and we've been moved and punished and punished and moved. I'm sure. And now I am told we are to be moved again. Clearly contravening the peace treaty signed three years ago. This will lead to war. No, my son, it will not. We cannot fight another war. They have got stronger, and we have become far weaker, Mr. Morgan. Well, it's a uh, bad business. It's to do with oil. I know it is, but I need the proof. I believe there were some prospectors who were on their land a few months ago who have filed reports with Leviticus Cornwall and the state government claiming huge reserves of oil under their land. So, you want me to try and steal it? Obviously they can't. <laughs> And even more obviously, I would be useless. <clears throat> Listen, I realize that it is a ridiculous request, but we're very desperate. Now, I'm not a do-gooder, Mr. Miller. Gentlemen, I'm very sorry for your predicament, but I'm a working man. I got problems of my own. We will pay you very handsomely, Mr. Morgan. How much? I told you, they're all mercenaries. <laughs> <laughs> There's a price on my head in two states, my friend. The government doesn't like me any more than it does you. Like you, I've been running for as long as I can remember. And like you, my time here but is But I, I just paid the bounty, so I shouldn't... We have... understand, and we will pay. Thank you. You meet my son in a couple of days near Citadel Rock, just west of the oil fields. Okay. We are very grateful for your help. Gentlemen, that appointment with the Senator... We should head over there. It's a waste of our time. And his. We must try everything. Come along. Hello, Mr. Miller. If the counselor wants to apologize, he can see you now. We've been waiting I don't know how long. Or next month, if you'd like to reschedule. Come. Perhaps the senator won't mind waiting. Yeah. Medieval flies here, all one can see. Okay, we'll do that. No problem, but I think that's uh, this way. Was mm, oh, it's from um, Okay, we'll just search for it. 
Uh, let's go for Tilly's mission then. But I think if we go for Tilly now, we have to. go to camp again and it's already 50 minutes so I'll just do this and end the video let's do this with Trelawney well I see you didn't get the message last time well I'll be keeping an eye on you that's for sure I paid my bounty fee. Look okay. who we have here. <laughs> that was some mess with McDaniels and Professor Lindsay Bell. You oh. ain't no executioner, that's for sure. Lindsay if you think you're a bounty hunter, though, there's a poster on the wall there. You going after Lindsay Waffles? I might be. I might just want to hang his poster up on my wall. Yeah, they're a bad lot, the Lamont Raiders. Stupid fellas won't leave good enough alone. One of these days, the government's gonna get sick of private militias, you know. One of these days, the government's gonna get sick of all of us. Don't tell them I said that. Okay, we, we will do that. Wait, wait, wait. I think this is the bounty. You can do this bounty, right? Nice, hundred dollars. Ten minutes. And just what do you need that gun for? Is it Take a right and go straight. Maybe I can take a place when I'm on. You're about to witness true justice in action. What the true justice? When a beautiful young lady ridiculed your disfigured, disfigured, you murdered her in cold blood. For your awful vanity and pride, you will pay. Oh, you! You remember me, friend? As you live. Help me out again. Any last yeah. words before okay. the noose? That ugly bitch deserved what she got. Uh, she deserved it. it. Seems it ironic, huh? Cool. Oh. Oh, there he goes. I heard the next snap. Damn. Cruel and abhorrent behavior will not stand in this else. country. These legs twitch. Justice won this battle, but the war is far from over. Heed these words. I the time for this. It's good, it's good. It's good. All right, girl. Yeah. All right, move. Maybe that guy also. So it's going to take time. It's just going to be fast. Other than this is more fun. Considering the guy just puts up the, the fight, I have my rolling block in one hand and the other side.
So, guys, I tell you guys that uh, some kind of fucking legendary animal. The 15th, as well as the 15th one, needs. If it comes to it, <clears throat> a federal warrant? No, 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 that don't mean much in a sovereign territory, mister. We've been beaten down and driven out enough. Let's make a stand, bo boys. We need a man on the cranker. Get him. Uh, you uh, heard, Lindsay? Get your uh, places. We're seeing some fighting today. Lindsay, uh, stop uh, messing with us. I shouldn't have killed him, man. They got a f- We're gonna hand you to the casualty list! Enforcement is here! Ah! They sent it for Whopper! Get him! You can see a gun here. I will take that, of course. Right here. I can't find it.
want to be something. It's not flaming anymore. See? What the fuck is this gun? What the fuck are you see this? Oh, we are going under Thompson. Take his body back to Saint Denis and put up the reward. This time we will get this one. That was a log box, that's why I did that. I see another log box here. Maybe that's a similar box or another log box. Okay, let's go on.
Come on, man, I'm already late. Every horse is doing this shit. Wait, wait, wait. Oh man, that's way bad. It's already one hour five minutes. Get you back. Here. Right. Okay, let's take this right. Let's get the fog. Let's turn it on. We go, we deliver the fog, we take the fog, and we end the fog. I just broke the glass with the intensity of Oh man, I have blood all over me. From the city of Song Dani to you, sir, with thanks. Looks 
So thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more and don't forget to subscribe and back with more exciting videos. Until then, stay tuned and have a good day. Anyways, see you soon.